I tried really hard to find my Mortal Kombat t-shirt, but I couldn't find it, so I found a, a Mario t-shirt that just says, My game, that says, My game is next level. I felt like that was kind of fitting. <laughs> How you doing guys, welcome back to another episode of Real Talk Reviews, and today we are going to be talking about... Mortal Kombat! Did it look cool? <laughs> So as you guys know, if you are a Mortal Kombat fan or a film fanatic, Mortal Kombat came out, the theatrical release came out the other day. Me and Jacob had the pleasure to go and go watch it. We didn't see a re an early release of it, but we, got, we went to go watch it anyway because we're not that important yet. But anyway, we saw the movie and we absolutely adored the thing. It was everything I was hoping that it was going to be for a Mortal Kombat movie and it hit every nail on the head. It was funny, it was fast paced, it didn't pan out to the audience, it didn't pan out to the fans of the material, and my god did it do the material, did it do the material justice, it did the fans justice. Everything from set design to story, you feel like you are watching a movie made for MK fans. From now on, I expect nothing but perfect video game adaptated movies, because the, this movie is straight up the video game, and I love it. There is nothing wrong with making a movie just like the video games. Because you know why? The video games worked. People like the video games. We went to go see it, the movie was fantastic. Going back to the other part, going back to the other bit of it, I'll try not to rant a little bit. I'll try not to rant. The fatalities were gory, the special effects looked fantastic, and all of the abilities that the characters have are believable to an extent. It is still a Mortal Kombat movie. <laughs> but all the characters that we know and love and grew up with, well, not all of them, if they put all of the characters in one movie, it would be a really clustered and really over the, overdone movie. But the characters that we get from Kano, Liu Kang, Kung Lao, Shang Tsung, Raiden, Reptile made an appearance, I think it was Reptile, Goro, Cabal, but these are characters that were done so well and were done with so much like You can tell the love went into the writing and the character development in these characters. Like Jax, for example. Even even like the new character that we got to see, Cole. You, I honestly didn't really expect to like him very much, but he ended up being one of my favorite characters in the movie. Goro was done so well. For a completely CGI character, you believe that he's there, and you believe that he, and he is a really powering presence. <laughs> you also see that they're also taking the story of Mortal Kombat. They're kind of leaning into the ridiculous side of it, because it is ridiculous when you think about it. Leaning into the whole fact that, like, there is this, uh, there are these realms besides ours, and that there are these competitions called, there are these competitions where people fight, where different champions fight to the death, and if you have the marking like Cole does, or the other characters do, then you have to fight in that tournament, and it is called Mortal Kombat. And they even point out that it's spelt wrong. <laughs> But even from like all the fights that they do, the training that they do, even some of the stuff that is so on the nose that real hardcore fans will really get, and I loved it. <laughs> and the selling point for this movie, the Sub-Zero and Scorpion conflict that across all Mortal Kombat fans is a constant, it worked. It, it worked. And they... It, it was brilliant. I, I loved it. I loved every bit of it. I thought that the end fight, I thought the beginning fight with Hanzo Hasashi and Bihan, yeah, that's right, I'm a Mortal Kombat nerd. I thought that that fight was so, I thought the choreography was fantastic, and I thought just the story behind the fight itself was brilliant. And then compare that to the end fight between the two, where you get Sub-Zero and Scorpion really hashing it out, Oh man, it is just an... It's brilliant. I, I loved it. I loved it. It was so gruesome. <laughs> but guys, that's all I have to say about the movie. It was really well done. It was so... It was such a fan service movie. It was done with the utmost care and love from the directors and the writers. 
and just the actors who played these phenomenal cat, like these fantastic characters, really played like really knocked it out of the park. Especially Kano, he was hilarious. <laughs> guys, I adored the movie. I loved it. I hope you guys do too. If you're Mortal Kombat fans, I I honestly do think that you'll enjoy this movie. I hope you guys enjoy it. Obviously, I did. If you guys want to see more of our stuff on the channel breakdowns or possibly more reviews coming in the future please be sure to like share and subscribe and if you want to see more of my face please be sure to follow me on instagram and twitter and guys as always keep it real stay sexy and i'll see you in the next video bye